Okay, I'm gonna pull in a whole finished track. Okay, this is a this is a student of mine, his track. I don't think he'll mind me using it. Okay, so I'm just gonna drop this right into my session. Solo this track. Okay, now you see how it took a second before it was enabled? That was live doing its analysis. So you can see this is a full track and all of these little tiny ticks here, those are the warp markers where it says something's going on. So this is gonna be a tricky one. Now, the first thing that I wanna tell you about warping whole tracks is that there's, there is a setting in live. If we go to our preferences and we go to record warp and launch warp settings, there is auto warp long samples on. You can turn that off. Um, you would turn this off if you're constantly loading in whole tracks or like long things whole tracks and you don't want it to warp them um, you can turn that off and then it's just going to open this a track like this and it's not going to warp it for you that's actually like kind of beneficial sometimes because most of the time if I'm loading in a whole track it's to do a mastering project or something like that where I don't want warping on but I'm going to leave it on for now you can also do this um, where you can say warp short samples and I always leave that set to auto, but there are some controls for that. You can say default warp mode beats. You can adjust that here too, but let's go back. So it warped this automatically. Now, is this correct? Did it warp it correctly? Without even listening to it, I'm going to take a guess and say that surprisingly, I think it did. And here's my clue. My clue is that there's no silence at the beginning. I see a new section here, like the waveform changes here, and it's pretty much right on. Same thing here and same thing here. Like I see things happening right where they're supposed to happen, kind of like sections are lining up. So I think this actually warped pretty well. So I'm going to turn on the metronome and listen to the beginning of it. Okay, so so far it sounds right on. 